Hey y'all, it's Trinity. Make the quick journal read. Messages are going to be for Sagittarius today. All right. These messages are just general for Sagittarius. Keep in mind. I think it resonates and if it doesn't. All right, Archangel Michael, give me a message here for Sagittarius. So we got the sun popping out. All right. The number 19 could be significant to some of you guys out there. All right. Um, sun card. Some of you guys could just like be basketing your ambience at this time. This could be a very abundant time in your life, Sagittarius. All right. Know everything is possible. All right. Some of you guys, there's some messages that's coming to you. It could be illuminating certain situations. Are you getting clarity on things that um that you've been seeking? All right. Some of you guys could be working on projects here. Um, something that you've been working on, maybe something that you left behind in the past or you felt stuck from. All right, something's about to come into fruition. I do see new relationships flourishing here. All right. It has something to do with personal growth. All right, y'all could be just in this giving energy here because we got the Ace of Waters at the bottom of the deck too. Okay, so we have Three of Waters. Three of Waters popping out for the uh, the next card. All right. So some of you guys, there's about to be something that you're, you're going to be celebrating. For some of you guys, this could be an actual marriage here. Some of you guys got a King of Pentacles in your energy, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, this person is sad. I don't know. Somebody could have tried to hold you back from a marriage. I feel like somebody's going to be watching you get married. All right. <clears throat> Some of you guys, there's a powerful uh, collaboration coming towards you here. This is somebody who's very goal oriented. And I feel like some of you got you, you and this person share mutual interests. All right. So for some of you guys, you already seen this here in a vision or the dream state. There is some sort of um, mental clarity that the most I has given you about some sort of project here. All right. This could be very competitive because with this hostilities card right here, it seems if like somebody's angry, Sagittarius. All right. For a missed opportunity, something was unjust here with the Six of Pentacles in reverse and the Nine of Wands. So if you guys were in a group and somebody tried to limit you, hold you back in some sort of way, you guys are going to be receiving this Ace of Pentacles because I feel like you guys are very dedicated here to whatever you're trying to bring into fruition. Some of you guys could have like a funder, somebody who wants to invest in whatever you're doing here. This could be an earth sign. The seven of waters, okay? Okay. Something to do with your imagination, Sagittarius. Y'all may need to tap into it at this time here. Some of you guys could be very artistic, or this is what you're going to be doing, working on arts and crafts, all right, co-creating with somebody. I do feel like here, maybe you guys' creative side has been suppressed. All of this is being pushed out to the forefront at this time. Y'all could just be feeling free, all right? Some, something's definitely coming into fruition. This is a, this is a, um, a creative project, some sort of creative project, and you will not be working alone. All right. Yes, new ideas. All right, or something that you've been curious about. Maybe it's something that you're curious about, but you haven't stepped into. Somebody about to try something new. 
It's going to bring in a hell of a lot of money. I'll tell you that for sure. Okay. Yeah, the shift. Beautiful, right? So this could certainly have something to do with mindset. We got rise. This is this is ascension here. All right, coming out of lack and drought. If you guys are in lack and drought, you're getting downloads at this time, telling you which direction to push, like to move towards here, because something's very lucrative. So if you keep on getting a download or spirit is telling you to do something, do it. All right. Praying is, is definitely significant at this time here. Some of y'all could be trying to get clarity on a decision that you're about to make. Spirit wants you to review all your options thoroughly here. Check in with your beliefs, your values, and your goals. Does whatever you're whatever you're going towards, does this resonate with your soul? So some of you guys are being called to guide, to, uh, to call on your guides here. All right. I'm also feeling now. Um, some of you guys could be feeling uneasy with a shift and a change going on in your life. So spirit wants you to sit still here. Be be um be okay with your feelings. All right. Vulnerability, anxiousness, all right, your passion, uh, whatever this is here it could be sparking some sort of feeling inside of you. Make sure you're able to go through the motions, all your emotions. Don't be ashamed to go through that um that shift. All right. Yeah, we got the light, all right? Two cards with the sun here, speaking about illumination, all right? Illumination, something coming to the light. I feel like you guys are the light at this time. That's why you're attracting people, all right? Certain people. But your dreams and desires are waiting for you, all right? So if there was a dark cloud over your head, like I said, if you were feeling vulnerable, some of you guys could have just came out of the dark night of the soul. Spirit wants you not to let people tell you who you are. Only you know who you are and only you can manifest the future that you desire. All right. It's a lot of help coming towards you guys. Be open to it. People who resonate with your soul, y'all. Sagittarius. Prayers and affirmations are significant. Mirror meditations. I am beautiful. I am loving. I am kind. Whatever I dream of, I can bring into fruition. All right. Yep, look, abundance. I am a limitless being and I can manifest whatever I desire into the physical reality. Beautiful. Some of y'all have this mindset at this time and it's about to bring you in a lot of joy, happiness. I'm aware that being happy means I'm on the right path. So with these shifts that's occurring in your life, if you are going through this, um, be sure to be grateful for what you have at this time so you could call more in and know that whatever situation you're in right now, that's not your ultimate uh, destination. That's not your final destination. But like I said here, some of you guys have some jealous people around you. So be careful how you move, who you tell your business to and things of that nature. Because, you know, when you are happy, you look the sun card. When you're happy, always know that there's always going to be somebody angry around you because um, misery loves company. All right. Give me a message here for Sagittarius. There are a lot of downloads, ideas coming to your head. Some of you guys, you're going to be guided towards people to go trustworthy people to talk to these ideas about to see what they think about it. And, you know, how you can involve them co-creating with others. I'm hearing the power of twos. Somebody's very angry that you're coming out your shell. I seen hostilities in Garden Gate. Somebody wants you guarded in a certain perimeter. Somebody could be trying to control your expansion. Somebody's doing a lot here. Instead of focusing on themselves, you guys have Archangel Michael protecting you. All right. 
We have community popping out as well. Some of you guys could be healers or something like that. There's certainly something here to celebrate for. Lucky number seven is here. Three women could be significant. Some of you guys may be collaborating with three women. Some sort of business. Some of you guys could be getting invited somewhere with, with gowns. This could be a ball or something like that. Or this could be your children's prom. Somebody child prom. All right. A wedding is significant here as well. Community, two of cups here with the Hierophant. Oh, some of y'all getting invited to a wedding or like I said, you're about to be married. All right. Give me a message here. Sagittarius. Some of y'all could be healing from a betrayal at this time. Ten of Swords in reverse wanted to pop out. All right, yeah, we got the Six of Wands. This is your energy here. All right. Success. Victories. Achievement. Some of you guys are about to be known for something or noticed for something. The Hermit. There's a light being shed on something you do here. I don't know if this is for work. All right. What's the, um, what's the Six of Wands? world fulfillment all right some of you guys are about to be celebrated if they're completion of a cycle okay some sort of celebration i'm also seeing travel here a successful travel maybe some of you guys do business uh you you you, you travel to do business all right some of you guys, there's a Leo here who's upset. I don't know if this person wants to communicate to you about something. Oh, the Ten of Pentacles. Some of y'all want a court case, all right? Or some sort of inheritance, a large lump sum of money, all right? Also seeing something here about a family business. Job security is significant here. Some of you guys are very affluent in your community here. Maybe this is why this angry person is, is around. But whatever you're about to bring in here is certainly long-term success. This could be a seven to 10 year cycle. All right, if they're feeling bound and stuck and trapped to a certain situation. Yeah, somebody's stepping in this emperor status. All right. We got the emperor and the queen of cups popping out as well. Some of the masculines, a masculine out there is about to enter fatherhood or something like that here. There's a masculine here who feel like they found the one. Queen of Cups with the Empress at the bottom of the deck. Y'all, but this person could be real... Um, I don't know, controlling y'all, so so very dominant energy. Mm. This person's emotional at this time for whoever this person is, this emperor. Or you bring out the emotions in this person. This person is coming towards you with the two of wands. They're trying to find a way how to. Somebody could feel like you're solely focused on work or money. This is what causes this person like to be stagnant here. But I do feel like they're releasing burdens. For some of you guys, this is how they feel about you. Um, somebody could be overwhelmed by their feelings here, all right? But I feel like somebody's releasing this at this time. Somebody's coming towards you. This person's like tying up loose ends. They're releasing something here with the Ten of Wands. Something that they've been struggling with. This could be their feelings or this could just be power and control. All right. What's the Ten of Wands in reverse? 
Queen of Cups is out here twice. This is certainly how they feel about you, all right? Somebody was really in their emotions about you. For some of you guys, this, this has something to do with your psychic abilities here, all right? Somebody don't want you to know how they feel or how they move. This could be why they revoke you, reject you, or they stay away from you here. Y'all could be dealing with an Aries or a Leo, heavy on a fire energy. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We also got a little bit of uh, earth energy here. The chariot in reverse. So somebody knows how they feel, but they're not taking action. I also feel like here, I don't know, maybe somebody's having car issues or something like that. Some of y'all could be dealing with a cancer. Somebody's having car trouble. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Knight of Wands in reverse. Maybe something to do with car, with uh, with uh, transportation. What's the two of wands? King of Wands in reverse. For some of you guys, somebody's working on their recklessness. This person's like heavy. I don't know, y'all. This person, this could be a Leo. Somebody's like really impulsive here with uh with passion and who they give it to. All right, because the King of Wands in reverse could be real materialistic here. Somebody could just be focused on money and sex or something like that. Somebody knows that you're gonna reject this. All right, maybe this person came towards you with this energy. And you did not accept that with the chariot in reverse. Somebody knew that they're toxic here or something like that. So I feel like some of y'all just working on y'all work until something like is able to come in and fit your needs. Yeah, six of pentacles to give equally to you. All right. I feel like, yeah, because y'all not stressing about this here. All right. For some of you guys, it is a burden here. Somebody's giving it two people, two or more people. Somebody's struggling trying to do this here. All right. This could be an earth sign or a fire sign. Somebody's giving to multiple people and they know that they cannot come towards you in this energy here. All right. Or some this is what somebody did. They came towards you, they bread crumbed you. All right, wasn't given equally. Y'all could have been burdened by giving to this person with the Queen of Cups double out here. This could have been given to this person emotionally. You trying to pour into somebody here. I feel like y'all protecting yourselves at this time with the Seven of Wands. This could also be somebody here that you're dealing with that constantly puts you on block. So when somebody's with somebody, they constantly putting you on block or something like that. I also feel like here, somebody feel like you too gushy and you too emotional and you know, they, they don't want that or something like that. I feel like this person is just not comfortable with being vulnerable. So, you know, if this is your energy and you're vulnerable and you're open and emotional and you like to express yourself, stay in that energy. All right. Stay in that energy. Don't stray away from who you are to please this person. All right. What's the cherry in reverse? I do feel like somebody's trying to block you energetically as well. Yeah, it's like, if I can't have you, you won't be happy. This is certainly a water sign who's trying to block you. All right. Somebody's doing the most here. I'm hearing enough. Yeah, this is very controlling. But I feel like they stripping themselves from their own happiness doing this. What's this King of Wands in reverse? Yeah, their behaviors are being illuminated. All right. Ten of swords, something to do with a betrayal here. Also for like here, y'all, for some of you guys, somebody that made a baby. Very impulsive how they moved. All right. I feel like they ain't happy about this. All right. What's the uh, six of pentacles? Somebody could be dealing with legality matters with a child in court. Or this is what's to come here in the near future. All right. What's the uh, Six of Pentacles? Somebody wants to bring balance to a situation. They don't know how to 
All right, we got the hybrid font. For some of you guys, this person's married or this person's in court. They're going to be paying out a hell of a lot of money to somebody who they were married to. This could be a Taurus. They manipulated something, but their manipulation is being blocked at this time. All right. Also feel like here, you guys, if this is a husband, you guys are in separation. You're blocking this person or something like that. You found out something.